Both teams have sent their special teams out of the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 26. Black five, black five. And he's level at the 22-yard line. Oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman, when the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday on that one. around the 29-yard line. So the defense does their job well on that series. The defense looks like they're going to send in the cavalry on this one. And this one is a beauty. The Zips in talking with them this week, Kirk, is just interesting their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself, and I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him to football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'd be shocked if they can slow him down. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. Fires quick after the receiver and he can't make the grab. From the 49 yard line, second down. He steps out around the 47 yard line. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. That was actually pretty good defense. But a great pass and a great catch were enough to overcome it. Watch the pass. Go, alert, alert, alert. Slings it, and he's tackled right around the 26-yard line. Number 12 makes the tackle at the 26-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Here's the eighth play of the series. Here's the halfback on the screen. Knocked out of bounds at about the 27 yard line. down so the kicking team is on the field they'll try for three Akron could take the lead with this field goal the kick is up and it is good 
The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Akron's really got things working right now for him. I can't think of a better start. Well, that's exactly the way they had hoped to see this game go. I mean, anytime you can start the game with a stop, get your offense out there, they move the ball down, put points on the board. Now it's just more about trying to maintain what they've already created. And he throws it away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. From their own 25-yard line, second down. On the ground, inside. They go to the left for a nice game. And a six-yard pickup by the halfback on the delay. running his routes, which is a truly underrated quality these days. It's first and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. Green nine, green and nine. They'll bring him down at the 49-yard line. Gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. Down again. Now he tries to buy some time. He's at the 40. And he shoved out of bounds around the 30 yard line. number eight on the drive. Caught with room to work. Steps out of bounds at the 24-yard line. So far this drive, the defense has been unable to stop them on third down. it go. Caught end zone for the touchdown. This offense just has so many weapons to defend. They've got some genuine playmakers. And he tacks on the extra point. A nine-play, 75-yard drive, and they put up seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. Sends it sailing downfield, and it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Set, blue 14, cut. He's tackled right around the 28-yard line. We played one quarter. Rutgers in front, 7-3.
Back to the action now here in the second quarter. Mike 22, he's coming, 22 is coming, Mike, Mike. Hey, keep it up. Keep there go. It and he's taken down at the 31. Game of three yards. That'll bring up 34. He's got it with room to run. First down. down. Roger, Roger. Mike's 22, Mike's 22. Here we go, here we go. Swings it out there incomplete. The ball just sailed on him and he knows it. He'll get it next time. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 35. Going deep, lays it up there. Oh boy, almost intercepted. Well, the offense catches a break here. That ball should have been intercepted there by the safety. So the quarterback gets the ball back here for this next down. Got it. And he goes down quickly. They've got 10 guys up. They're coming after the kick. Oh, excellent punt. From the 15, brought down at the 23-yard line. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Rutgers holds a four-point lead. Here's the halfback. And they make the stop around the 22-yard line. Just nowhere for the ball carrier to go as the linebacker met him in the backfield. Boy, what great play recognition by this linebacker. He saw the run was coming, and he just shot through the gap and made a great tackle. From their own 22-yard line, it's second down. Now they run it left, and a nice tackle right there. That makes it third and 11. Red two, orange three, orange three. Go! Quick strike and he drops it, and that will make it fourth down. The offense really had nowhere to go on that one. The play was very well defended, and now the incompletion will force the fourth down and a punt. It's away and it's a booming punt. They bring him down, and they bring him down hard on that one. Momentum swings have been fairly even, and with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Almost intercepted there. This just shows you that you don't need to be sacking the quarterback to disrupt the passing game. From their own 36-yard line, it's second down. Aaron and out long. Missed it. That's pretty much the best way to make sure the receiver doesn't catch it. He just put his pads on him the second he touched it. Throws it deep. Almost intercepted. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Gets out to about the 31. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Rutgers is up by four. Tackle right around the 42-yard line. 
from their own 42 yard line. It's first down. And he gets a yard on the run. That's a gain of one on the way. That brings up second and nine. Four-yard line. Pick up of a yard for the Eight tailback. One yard. That makes it third and seven. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. Three down, three down. Hey, check Mike 47. Check Mike 47. Go. Green nine, okay. green nine. Action. Seven. Taken down the 42 yard line. Sometimes when you've got speed, that's all you need. It's the one thing you just can't defend. Throws it in a hurry. How about that play? That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. That'll make it second and four. They're about four yards yeah, away here up. on second down. down, down. Hey, check Mike 47. Check Mike 47. Red two. Blue 20. Yeah. And they'll bring him down behind the line. That was a loss of three yards. Third down. Four down, four down. 47 Mike. Rutgers is up four. Here we go, here we go, here we go. X7. Throws a strike over the middle. Tackle made at about the 29 yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. It's caught Knights taking their first time out of the half. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. They'll drop him for a loss. Defense had that one called perfectly. That's a big play on that loss. Tenth play of the drive. Red two. Strike and it's caught for the touchdown. So the referee initially calls it a catch, but we'll get a second look at it here and determine if he was in bounds when he hauled it in. And that play happened so fast that it was very tough to tell if he was able to get a foot down or not. After, After review, review of the play, play the, the ruling on the, on the field, field stands. stands. After review, they decided that the call on the field will stand. And he hits the PAT. An 11 play, 70 yard drive. And they come away with seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown. Drive. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Zips know, I think, that at some point they just have to do what they do, even if it's not working right now. If they can get it going in the second half, it should really improve the ball game and the offense. Well, the offensive line, I think, also has to be accountable here. Uh, we look so much to our star players, and we always want them to put up big numbers. But to me, the two go hand in hand. When a running back's going to have a great game, the offensive line deserves some credit. When a running back's struggling, you got to look at that offensive line and say, fellas, you got to help me out. We're not going to change or deviate from this game plan. We need to be able to change this game around, and it starts up front with the offensive line. Brought down at the 33-yard line. Number 12, 
And he hits him hard at the 36-yard line. Well, the idea here was obviously not to try anything tricky or force the ball down the field. A simple throw, and they got the first down that they needed. It's a bad play overall by the offense. The quarterback's doing everything he can to be able to make the play work and try to execute. The problem is the offensive line did not do a good job protecting him. They're very fortunate that ball wasn't intercepted. Setting up blockers, the running backs got it on the screen. They'll bring him down at the 43. So we're looking at another third down here. A seven-yard pickup on the screenplay. They executed the screenplay well here by getting the ball to the halfback. They pick up some yards. He airs it out. Got it to the senior. Touchdown, Zips. A beautiful pass and a nice catch. Well, this is one of those plays you just sit back and admire. The quarterback threw the ball perfectly. And again, the speed of the receiver is the difference in this play. That's a great touchdown, Brad. But what happened to the coverage there by the defense? The defensive coordinator's got to be beside himself. You know, you work all week long on studying an offense and their tendencies, and then to have a mental error and to leave the star receiver open like that for a touchdown? Well, they've got to regroup. That's the end of the half, and believe it or not, folks, it's still anyone's ball game. 14-10, Scarlet Knights. And we welcome you back to the action here, just about set for the second half. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Man, both offenses here in this third quarter have been on fire. Time for the defense to step to the forefront a little bit. Makes you wonder which of these defenses has the ability to come up and make a stop. It could be one of those games where whichever defense comes up with that stop could be the team that wins the game. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure, but they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. On the run, right side. He makes it to the 25-yard line. That makes it second and 10. He's tackled at the 39. That's a game of 13 yards three. on the play. Pick it up, First pick it down. Up. Pick it up. Just throws this one away. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 39. And they push him out around the 49-yard line. That's a gain of 10 on the play. That'll bring up third and inches. Mike, 22, he's coming, 22's coming. Mike, Mike. Big opening. Tackle that side after a nice pickup. Gain of four on the play. First down. Mike, 22, Mike, 22. Now he's scrambling. He's got the corner. And he's taken down around the 44 yard line. That's a game of three. That makes it second and eight. Quick pass. That's a great tackle the 42 so it's complete but they didn't get much there and that's because the defense was just waiting on it and they attacked the quarterback should have found somebody else downfield quick throw got some open field and they make the stop at about the 11. that's a game of 31 on the play that makes it first and 10. Touchdown, Akron! Boy, he looked determined. 
Herman running the football. Nobody was going to keep him out of the end zone. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Well, this is a competitive game. It's fun to watch these two teams go back and forth. Just when you think one team has the edge, the other gets right back into it. This is exciting. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Give to the running back, and he's going to lose yardage. From their own 24-yard line, second down. Nice run there. Third down. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Green nine. Green nine. Tackle at about the 41. From their own 41 yard line. First down. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. Second down, five to go. Ball on the 43. And he tackles him hard at the 49-yard line. That's a loss of 80 yards. That brings up third and 12. He's going to try to cough and corner this one. And this one is a beauty. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Akron holds a field goal lead. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. Makes the tackle, tackle at the 26 yard line. line. Here we go. That'll Here we bring go. up third and four. 22, back 22. Go! There's a strike complete. And down he goes around the 35 yard line. Number 21 makes the tackle at the 35 yard line. First down. 22, he's coming. 22's coming. Mike, Mike. I got go. it. Has it to the senior. He's taking it. Around the 42 yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Check, check out. Disco Razor. Disco Razor. That's a game of two on the That'll make for the one. 22 by 22. Go, check. Disco Razor. Check, Disco Pressure coming. Get to that quick 
Victory. Tackle made at the 32-yard line. From the 32-yard line, first down. Is up by three. Goes a laser across the middle, and he's tackled. Twenty-six. Number twenty-nine on the tackle. Twenty-six yards. Like twenty-two, he's coming. Third down. So at the end of the third quarter, Akron leads 17-14. Great three quarters of action, tight ball game, and now it's the fourth quarter, and this will decide it. They'll line up with five wide receivers. And he's level at the 20. Well, they're living on the edge here a little bit, but you know, they're converting when they have to. That makes it first and 10. Mike 22, he's coming, 22, he's coming, Mike, Mike. They go, 28, 28, motion. He fights forward to about the 19. About a yard there on the quarterback. Play here by the freshman safety. He made the run and made a good tackle. He scrambled. They bring him down. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. That's what happened there. So again, a third down as the offense lines up. He'll see what the defense does with a five wide out. He rifles it to the left. Akron is up a field goal. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Throws complete. He's got room to work. And he is drilled at the 43-yard line. their own 43 yard line it's first down Dog four. Green. they'll work the left side he makes it out to maybe the 46 yard line
They're about four yards away here on second down. Just under three to go in regulation. Red two, three, nine. Kill, kill. Panther two. Nearly intercepted. Number 45 on the coverage. That'll bring up 34. Four down, four down. 47 Mike, 47 Mike. Mike, 47. Red two. Orange three. Throws it in a hurry. He's knocked out of bounds at the 28-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 28. Here's the eighth play of the series. Ball on the 13. They'll try to tack on the extra point that will take the lead. Looks like they didn't get the playoff quick enough. Offense. Just under two minutes in the game. He makes the PAT. Rutgers lines up for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Zips coaching staff and the entire team knows that this is the guy that can win it for them. The offense has to find a way to get the football into the hands of this running back, whether it's a, a simple toss sweep or maybe a ball out of the backfield where he can catch it in space. Any way that they can get the football to him to see if he can spring one to maybe get the field goal range or who knows, maybe take it to the house. This one is bad of the way. It's second and ten. Ball on their own 25. Mike 22, he's coming. 22 is coming. Mike, Mike. This is four. Slings it, brought down, right around the 42-yard line. That's a game of the First down. Take go! Set as you can go! How did he drop that? The defender did everything that he needs to do. He read the play perfectly. He stepped up, and what does he do? Drops the interception. Boy, the offense caught a break there. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Throws. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. 
Brady drops the ball here. I don't know if he's starting to peek downfield and think about the return or what, but that ball's right in his hands. He just dropped it. Just over a minute left. Just a tremendous job by that defense, and their coordinator did a super job there to keep it this close in this ball game. And now the offense has got a chance to win it. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. Fires out to his wideout. He's on the run. They'll bring him down at the 27. With the tackle. Check, check. Disco Raver. Disco Raver. That makes it first and 10. Check, check. Disco Raver. Disco Raver. Touchdown. What a run to take the lead. Well, they're going to try for the two-point conversion. The offense didn't get the playoff in time. Delay of game, offense. Little stumbles like these can kill your offensive progress. So the offense is going to go for two. He's got it for two. So with less than a minute to go in the fourth quarter, the score is 28-21, Akron. Akron gets set to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Scarlet Knights have played poorly all day long. That really doesn't matter right now. Well, they've played sloppy. They're not going to be happy when they go back and look at the film on Monday. But with all that being said, they still have a chance to win this game. And at the end of the day, that's all that matters is trying to get that W. We have less than a minute to go. Here's the throw. I don't think he got anything on that. The Scarlet Knights will use their first time out of the half. From their own 27-yard line. Second down. He's under pressure. And he shoved out of bounds right around the 34. How about that play? That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. Playmaker tight end makes those linebackers think twice before they make a move. That could be just enough time for the quarterback. Green nine, green nine, green nine, green nine. Go, kill, kill, kill. Go. And they make the stop right around the 44 yard line. The spike will stop the clock. That'll bring up third and eight. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48s. Four down, four down. 47 Mike, 47 Mike, Mike 47. And two. Hit. They go to the screen here, and the halfback's got it. He's tackled at the 42. for the touchdown. Well, if ever there was a big extra point to be had, then this is it. To go to overtime. He got it. We're going to overtime. 
And that's the end of the fourth quarter, and we're going to take this deadlock into overtime. Back to the action here, and we get ready for overtime. rid of this one. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 25. Tackle around the 17-yard line. rid of this one. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. So the kicker will come out and try to build a three-point cushion here in overtime. He gets it up, and it is good. The kicker does his job, but now it's up to the defense. They're going to have to stand up and make a big stop. This is very nerve-wracking for both teams, because now anything can happen on this second series of overtime. Trying to set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback. He's in for the score, and this game's over. But both teams have been fighting hard the entire game, and it just gets tougher in overtime. These guys deserve a world of credit for pulling this one out because it's been a real battle. And this one's all but wrapped up with the final score, Akron 34, Rutgers 31. Rutgers 31. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.